Hi everyone, new topic effect of temperature on viscosity of fluids. See what is viscosity? Viscosity is resistance to flow. About viscosity and Newton's laws of viscosity, I already gave a presentation and the presentation link I will post in the comment box. Now I am going to explain today's topic. Okay, that is effect of temperature on viscosity of fluids. The two factors, the two predominant factors affecting viscosity is that first one is cohesive force. Second one is molecular momentum transfer. See what is cohesive force? Cohesive force means it is the force of attraction between similar molecules. Cohesive force means it is the force of attraction between similar molecules. Okay, if the force of the force of attraction between dissimilar molecule, what you will call that is called adhesive force. Here I am going to address cohesive force. That the effective cohesive force means the molecule should be the condition. The condition of effective cohesive force means molecules separated by short distance or very near. If molecules will be very near, effective cohesive force exists. Okay, so this cohesive force will resist the flow. So more cohesive force, more viscosity. Second one, molecular momentum transfer. What is molecular momentum transfer? It is the collision between molecules and after collision they will exchange momentum. That is called molecular momentum transfer. And the effective condition of molecular momentum transfer means molecules should be separated by large distance. Then effective collision takes place and effective momentum exchange also takes place. So, molecular momentum transfer also resists the flow. More MMT, more viscosity. Okay, what about fluid? In the fluid means uh, that collectively we can call liquid and gas. Collectively we will call fluid. So, in the case of liquid, in the case of liquid, the molecules were separated by short distance. Okay, short distance. Molecules were very near. So, near means cohesive force is predominant. Because nearest molecule, similar molecules were very near and there exists a force of attraction. So cohesive force is predominant. What about MMT, molecular momentum transfer? So nearest molecule, there, there will not be an effective collision. The nearest molecules, there will not be an effective collision and no effective momentum exchange. So this, this MMT don't have that much importance in the case of liquid. Okay, so once you increase the temperature, once you increase the temperature, molecules have a tendency to escape. So they will try to break the bonds and their tendency to escape. So the intermolecular force of attraction will reduce. It means cohesive force, the predominant, the predominant factor will reduce. Once you increase the temperature, cohesive force will reduce and viscosity will reduce. So, in short, in short, you can tell increasing temperature for liquid, increasing temperature, viscosity, that is mu, will decrease. Okay. What about the gas? What about the gas? In gas, we know molecules were separated by large distance. So, separated by large distance, we know MMT is effective. MMT is effective. Molecular momentum transport is effective because separated by large distance effective collision takes place and there exists a momentum exchange okay why cf that is cohesive force don't have that much importance they don't have that much importance why because they were separated by large distance there is no effective intermolecular force of attraction so cf don't have that much importance so the predominant factor in gas is mmt Okay, molecular momentum transfer. Once you increase the temperature, molecules will get kinetic energy. So once the molecules get kinetic energy, they will move fast. They will move fast. Fast collision. Fast collision takes place. That is effective collision takes place and they will exchange momentum fast. So momentum exchange also very fast. So MMT will increase. Increasing temperature, momentum, molecular momentum transfer will increase. So, if MMT will increase, viscosity will increase. So, in short, you can write, in, in, in the case of gas, increasing temperature, 
viscosity will increase okay in the case of liquid increasing temperature viscosity will reduce but in the case of gas increasing temperature viscosity will increase and very important point is that in the case of liquids the predominant factor is cohesive force but in the case of gas the predominant factor is molecular momentum transfer okay okay thank you